Well, to start with, I will say let the government look about the insecurity on those farmers that are trying to farm. A bean is a seed of several plants in the family of leguminous plants known as fabaxi, which are used as vegetables for human or animal food. They can be cooked in many different ways, including boiling, frying, and baking, and are used in many traditional dishes throughout the world. Additionally, beans are a strong plant-based source of protein, fiber, iron, and vitamins that offers many health benefits. Beans may be good for someone's heart, guts, and liver health. Beans are usually cooked or boiled with palm oil spices and seasoning and eating either alone along with rice, gari or fried ripening plantains. Beans are common staple food among many Nigerians because of its nature to give a feel of satisfaction and fullness when eating, especially among the country middle class people. Recently, as with the prices of other staple food items like rice, the price of beans which are different kind have risen above most citizens' monthly payroll. When BTV News crew visited the popular New Benin market, some of the trade as who spoke gave the current prices of beans per cup, per rubber and bag. For example, a cup of ordinary white beans now says for between 500 to 550 naira, while the rubber says at between 5,000 to 5,500 naira. A bag of white beans says for as much as 200,000 compared to 70,000 or 80,000 naira before. As for brown beans, a cup is 600 naira, while a rubber now says at between 6,000 to 6,700 naira. Also, the popular sweet sign is size beans called Uloka now says at 600 per cup and 6,000 naira per rubber. The traders added that the bags of Uloka beans and brown beans can now be purchased at 250,000 naira. However, they attributed the soaring prices of beans to the high cost of transportation due to high fuel pump price and the state insecurity in the farmlands as well as other weather conditions such as flooding where these nutritious staple food items are cultivated. They therefore appeal to the federal government to intervene in reducing the rate of food inflation by maintaining a favorable price regime and tackling insecurity as well as the flooding issues. These actions they believe will help to reduce hunger and feed the nation's poor. The rubber is 5,500. Now the medium size, now 5,500. Everything to them, now even though if they tell themselves five, make them buy and like that, they know they agree buy them. They say two costs. Everything where they say is safe is too cost. Even I safe. Like the brown beans, the cup is five fifty, while the rubber is six thousand seven hundred. How much was it before? Uh, before it was formerly maybe three fifty per cup, while the rubber was like let's say three thousand. But the thing just skyrocketed just like that. So then the white beans, the white beans is. 5,400 by rubber. Cup is 500. Cup 500, then the rubber is 6,000. Then the white beans, cup is 500, then the rubber 55. Then brown beans is 6,000 per cup. This is 100 per cup. No, rubber 7,000. Many Nigerians hope that the implementation of favorable agricultural policies will help check the problems of soaring food prices. Joyce Eri reporting for BTV News.